laying it back. Finds William O'Donoghue. Kyle Hayes hits it firmly, but it's just to the left of that. Limerick have now registered 17 minutes this All Ireland final, but look what they've scored. Three goals and 22 points. They lost the All Ireland final in 1933, won it again in 34, lost 35 and won 36, and the same with 73 and 74. But now, for the first time in Limerick's history, they're going to put back to back All Ireland titles together. As Tata Corgan sends that between the posts. The Limerick fans beginning to cheer. And rightly so. The Limerick fans responding because they're seeing themselves in the big screen, but they're also acknowledging one of the finest displays we've ever seen in an All-Ireland final. No matter what Cork tried to do, they were being deprived by a Limerick team that is just magnificent. Won every line on the field. Dean Lynch has the composure to give it all the way back for his Barry Nash. Free for Limerick from way back. It was an advantage being given all that time. And eventually, the referee says no. It's going to be an opportunity for Aaron Gala once again. The atmosphere was electric at the beginning. Huge disappointment, I know, from Cork. But right now, Limerick people know that they're on the verge of history. comes back off the post. Referee blows the full-time whistle. And Limerick and John Carling have deservedly won the All-Ireland title in 2021. John Carling and Kieran Kingston congratulate and commiserate with each other respectively. But for the people of Limerick, this is historic. This is wonderful. They deserve every accolade that describes their performance on the field today. What a display, particularly in the first half. It was unbelievable. 3.18 on the board at half-time, 3.16 from play. The second half, obviously the life went out of it. You can't keep it up, they hit a lot of wide. But, the, but particularly Keane Lynch in the second half, he just gave an exhibition of hurling. But right across the team, you mentioned in your commentary earlier, there is no weakness in this Limerick team. Um, they're starting